Yo, today we're going to be reacting to the American people and what they think and what they have to say about this assassination attempt on former President Donald Trump. So if you're sensitive, I'm just warning you right now, step away, okay? Without further ado, let's rock! Donald Trump almost got assassinated. What do you think? Yeah, it's very scary, very scary. I think it's awful for America what happened. Um... He's the only man who can change this country. That was a, like a powerful moment after like he got shot. Bro got shot in the ear. Yeah. And he he like I don't know, he showed everyone that he's strong and stuff. So he got hit and then he started touching it after, but you're talking about like the way he just got yeah. right back up like I a gangster. Don't even know, though, that shit was crazy to be honest, but hell yeah. Biden is toast. Yeah. I'll tell you <laughs> one thing, I'm gonna be voting Trump 2024. This is my answer. What does it say? What was your thoughts about the assassination attempt? They missed. They missed. They missed. <laughs> do you, do you, yeah, um, he should have died. He's not good for this country, and he never will be. Wow. Ever. He's the worst person that could be ever in politics. It's a, oh, it's a false flag. False flag. Yeah, false flag. People, somebody died and two people injured. What do you think about that? False flag. False flag. I thought it was magnificently staged. It was professionally done. It almost looked real. Wait, wait, wait. Staged by who? Oh, by Mr. Trump, of course. I think this whole thing is staged. You think it's staged? Yeah. It depends on everybody's view. Yeah. Obviously. View of the assassination yeah. attempt? What do you think? Does it does it kind of depend on where you're standing, whether or not you agree with the assass assassination attempt or disagree with it? I'm sorry, guys. I couldn't hold it anymore. I had to. What in the world did that man just say? Yo, son. Like, people, this is my problem, guys. I get, you have a right to think what you want to think. If you think it's staged, okay, no problem. My problem comes, it was it's staged, but it's not fake because somebody did pass away. That's legit, right? So I, I don't know, it, where's the line between that? Does that make sense? Like it's staged and somebody, when somebody passes away, I say it's, I don't say it's staged. That you gotta throw that stage shit out. Excuse my French, throw it out, right? Back to the video. <laughs> I just don't see, I just don't see that being the truth, but that's my, I just, I'd rather just not make any comments. Really quick, what's the, no. what's, what are you talking about the truth? What do you mean? Oh, you just don't believe it was an assassination no. attempt. No, no, no. Please don't. No. We're so anti-Trump, I don't even want to it, Was it a bad thing, though? Uh, I mean, I... Honestly, I was it a bad thing? Would you condemn it? Oh, that he got oh, shot? Yeah. Of course. Yeah, you never right. do that. Of that's course, all. you don't do that. That's all mess. Yeah, that's, no that's really bad. No matter, yeah, exactly. You don't do that. Was it staged? Probably. Staged? Yeah. Okay, so you think Trump maybe staged a fake assassination for support? Okay. And, and, and that resulted in somebody dying and other people being critically I, I injured? Haven't, I haven't seen the news today. I'm not here for the news. I haven't yeah, seen Yeah, exactly. You, you guys see, want to weigh in? What do you think that? about you it? You see that? Look, all the people, all the... <clears throat> Yo, if you're going to say, you're going to come and say the stage, I'm going to come through this screen and slap you. Because look, all the people that, I'm just joking, by the way, you have a freedom to say and think wherever you want to think here. This is a safe space, guys. If you want to come and say that, you can say that. But look, this is what I will say. Um, <laughs> I shouldn't even be laughing because it's really not funny. Like somebody actually did pass away. A man passed away shielding his daughter and his, uh, you know, the, then the wife. So, um, and other people were, were critically injured. Um, so now if that wasn't the case and it was just Trump, then I would be like, I would, I would definitely, I would still think it was, you know, cause again, it did, didn't look staged, you know, that's my problem, but I don't know. Back to the video. Very upsetting. Very upsetting. What do you think, really sir? Is. Same upsetting. Shouldn't be done. Shouldn't have happened. Poor Trump. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. He doesn't deserve that. You know, there's there's no place for it here. Um, it's just complete shock. It's horrific. Yeah, there should be no violent violence on any party, any side. So I'm I'm not a Trump voter, but violence is not an option. Well, has that just uh, strengthened your support for the man? I think all across the United States, it's just like when it happened to President Reagan. There was a surge of feelings for him. Yeah, 1981 that happened. Yes, and I think similar thing is going to happen with Trump. It doesn't matter. Like, I was at the beach yesterday. Right. That happened. I'm going to go on with the rest of my life, politically wise. Like, it doesn't affect me. It doesn't affect, you know, my local government as much. I guess it kind of seemed like it was coming. Like, there just seems to be a lot of animosity um, from one side more than the other that would indicate this kind of thing happening. So you're disappointed that the shooter missed Donald yeah, Trump? 100%. 100%.
No, no, well, nothing. Do you you should have died. Do you, she doesn't like him as much as I do, but she's a little more sympathetic to people do you, dying. Do you think that the shooter was justified? He did what he wanted to do. Do you think it was justified? Like, do you think, do you think he How can you live life like that? Yo, what is wrong with homie? Yo, back to the video. Size, I'm sure it was, but you know what? Since he missed, I can guarantee you there's gonna be a hundred people that are gonna try to not miss. Would you support that? Yeah, 100%. He doesn't need to live. He doesn't need to be a president. Did you see the I, video? I saw the video and... What'd you yeah, think about the video? It's shocking. It'd be, it, to, to actually see the bullet going by and, and... Yeah, thank God he wasn't hurt. I started crying. You didn't see the bullet now, honey. It's but terrible. okay. I don't think it, there's anyone around here that hasn't seen it. I saw him giving his fist. What'd you feel in that moment? A more support for him. You see that he got back up, raised his fist. I want your opinion on this Time Magazine cover right here. I want your thoughts on this cover. Uh, that is going to be history. That is going to be on everything for a long time. I think it's amazing. Yeah, I think it won him the election. Hell yeah, that, that shit goes hard. Pretty badass, dude. Okay. I've seen some people put it on like weed already, on weed packages. Someone got a tattoo and shit, so. The MAGA, I, the MAGA Kush? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm just alive in it. I'm just experiencing it. I mean, it's pretty punk rock, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's an epic photo. That is my favorite picture of all of them. That's my favorite right there. I don't know. It looks like power to me. It looks like maybe a uh, former president coming back, you know? Yeah. You got one hell of a publicity photo. Um, it's pretty hardcore. It's hardcore. I mean, it speaks volumes. And I'm not, I'll tell you right now, I'm not pro Trump. I'm definitely not pro-Biden, but when I saw that image before it was even posted, I was stunned because I knew it was going to resonate with a lot of people. I just see as someone who is, um, who, who have the determination to fight for the country. Mm. Yeah, as, as a, a symbol of a hero mm. of the country. Lucky to be alive, but he's a great American. Yeah, see, that's what I'm saying. I think that's gonna galvanize uh, the Trump team, for sure. What, All just, pro uh, Trumpers, for sure. Really? I don't like it. You don't like this image? No. I don't like that image. Every, everyone's saying it's badass. You disagree with them? I disagree, yeah. yeah. What do you think about it? You, you don't like it for why? Why do you not like it? Why don't I like it? Because when I see that, I think of everything that Trump stands for and his party. And although, you know, he hasn't endorsed Project 2025, I really think that this photo is like, it's, it's scary. It reminds me of everything that was happening in Germany before the start of World War II. So a lot of people are talking about the media's Yo, and this is the problem with the media. What are you talking about, bro? First of all, let me explain something to y'all. Come, come in, come, come closer, come closer. Hitler, because that's what people talk about. You know, he wouldn't, because people compare him to him, right? First of all, fact check me if you want, but this has never happened to him before in terms of him getting shot like that and not even almost assassinated. Like, you know, he got shot. You know what I'm saying? Hitler's running. You know what I mean? He, Go, we got to get out. We got to get out. Everybody's running. And, you know, he's not putting his fist up saying fight. You know, there's bluffers and then you have the real, the real deal, right? You know, you can't compare the two. I hear some people that want to. I feel like that's the media getting in people's head. Uh, back to the video. Coverage of Donald Trump over the last eight years, celebrities celebrating fake killing him, comparing him to Hitler nonstop. Do you not think that there's kind of a concoction here for a potential assassination attempt? Do people not hate him enough for this to be real? I think anybody who's in well placed in politics is a potential target, no doubt about that. And I think Donald Trump engenders hate because he's such a vicious, vindictive, hateful man. So naturally, he has a lot of enemies. That's understandable that he's saving democracy or America or whatever. For sure. I mean, I'm not a Trump supporter, but that's not right. But you don't see him as Hitler? No. Fair enough. What do you think? Do you see Trump as Hitler? Yes, I do. That it would be expected. Right. Coming from that kind of rhetoric. Like, right. who wouldn't want to end Hitler's life, like, kind of thing. Yeah. So you just thought it was it was fake? Of course. One person died in the crowd, two critically injured. What yeah, happened there? small price. It doesn't ma wouldn't matter to Trump. Do you think he cares if people die? For for him to be elected, that doesn't What are you talking about? Now, staged uh, from whose side? Do you think Donald Trump staged it for attention? Could be, or it could be the other side trying to make a scene or something, but I, I don't, the fact that he only got his ear and he would like sit up and said America, I don't know, come on. Right. It doesn't feel normal. Part of me at first thought, maybe it was like a setup to where he got shot on purpose to do that, but 
I don't think anybody would take a shot in the ear that close. What is our evidence for suggesting that it was a staged, a fake assassination attempt? I think that he walked away alive with alive. perhaps a scratch on his ear. Yeah, at, at grazed most. his ear. Yeah, yeah. Of course, you know, behind the scenes, they were, that was all fabricated. Some noise, they put a little scratch on his ear, threw a little blood on his face. Uh, now, so you think that they planned from 130 yards away to shoot? I, I, I want to smile, and I'm not, I, but the problem is, is that people pass away, so I'm really trying to be very sensitive here. Back to the video. Off the corner of his ear? And they never shot off the corner of his ear. That was all done by the people hanging around him. Okay. Nobody ever shot off his ear. Okay, okay, so you, you just see it grazing his ear as maybe not, you know, maybe not real. What yeah. about the people that died in, what about the father that died in the stand as well as the others that were know. critically That's injured? I don't know, I'm not, I can't tell, but I mean, no, 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 no. No, he, like no, he doesn't know. Dying for this cause. I'm so sorry for that person's family. So, so you think, I mean, if we're no, thinking not. that the Trump, I mean, that's no, a big not. thing to think is, is that Donald Trump's administration faked an assassination, got people killed to try to do this. What is our, what would you say our reasoning is for saying that? Or, or we have no reasoning? Just the feeling. Just the feeling. I haven't paid attention to anything right now because that's not where my mind is at right now. Okay. So as of right now, I just, like I said, I didn't even want to talk about it. <laughs> if we're not paying attention, is the right move to say that Donald Trump staged the assassination and faked an assassination against himself? Is that the right move? Or is it just, is the right move just to say, I don't know? I'm just going to say, I don't know. I'm on vacation. Oh, well, you know, you're against uh, fake news, Donald. How about against being against all this other fake crap that you pull? If Trump is involved, it's a fraud. You know, I'm going to just put myself out there. I got shot too before, like two times in my back and shit. So from my point of view, like if Trump got hit, like I feel like he would have just dropped if it was a headshot. Like I don't think he would be able to like he got, touch he got it. the tip of his ear yeah, nicked by the bullet. Know. Okay, for yeah. sure. That's what the report is. The report is he got the tip of his ear nicked yeah, by a bullet. He's blessed, you know, that fool didn't get hit in his skull and stuff, but I don't know, maybe it was real. What, do you, what are your thoughts about those people? Are they foolish for believing that this is a real assassination attempt? Yeah, a are lot of foolish? people are easily fooled by Donald Trump. Yeah, yeah, they're foolish. Do you think that this sealed the deal for Donald Trump for the election this year or no? Well, nothing's ever 100%, but I, I think a lot of people that were sitting on the fence are now, uh, have made their decision. After the, maybe after the debate and then out following this, it's yeah, just okay. Exactly. No, I think Trump was gonna win the election because of the debate. This is just gonna send it over the roof, man. Does he have it in the bag now? Oh, 100%. I think he has it wrapped up now because of this. So you think that this significantly impacted the election this year? I think so. Especially him putting a fist up afterwards. Yeah. I feel like he just secured a lot more votes. I mean, already look it. It's, it's been what, yesterday? And you got all these flags out here, all these people. Yeah. I mean, I'd say he's got a pretty good chance. I think liberals won't change their minds because of this. Did this solidify his victory for the pre presidential election this year or no? We're talking an assassination attempt. No, I don't think so. You don't think so? What do you think? No. Yeah. I'm asking both people on the left and the right. If you have a message for Donald Trump, let's say he's here right now, what would it be? Um, just know that you're supported and that even though he went through that obstacle yesterday, uh, yesterday obviously, that it's just one small bump in the road and we're gonna bounce back and um, just don't give up, keep fighting. To a former president that, that almost got assassinated, what would you say to him? I'd walk away. I'd have nothing to say to him. No. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, guys, that's pretty much it. Uh, we're going to end it here. And, uh, yeah, let me guys know. I want to know what you guys think. Like, like, let me know what you think in the comment section below. All right? I'm very curious to know. All right? And, um, yeah, do you think that it was staged? Do you think that it was legit? And then, yeah, let me know. And, shoot, me, as far as me, what I think... <laughs> Well, look, <laughs> check it out. I can't think it was staged if somebody passed away. I'm sorry. This is just not me. So you can take it or leave it. But that's just me. And uh, until next time, I appreciate you guys' support. Love y'all. Peace.